Well, I've always had tremendous um, ad admiration for this fellow. He started uh, having won the intermediate light heavyweight title of Great Britain as, as a, the unpaid ranks, turned pro in the early 70s, and he trains really hard. And I really think that he'll get somewhere towards the title one day. Checked away, round three. Round three, six to go. No score, Ray Steele, blonde from Yorkshire, on the left there in the trunks, versus Pat Roach. Big Pat Roach is his build, and that is right. 19 stone, 12 of him. Good drop kick, reached right over the top of the shoulder to get it, but he made it. bit too near the ropes to really make it count, but it, it was pretty accurate. taking two or three of those steel now. Must be weakening him slowly. Yes, caught him on the knee drop. And a follow down cross press very quick. Could have it here. He has the first one to Roach in round three. And it took him one minute, 32 seconds. But it certainly wasn't easy. And Steele going, coming over to, to congratulate him on that uh, fall. But there's time to go yet. And I wouldn't be at all surprised to see Steele, smaller though he is, making a comeback here. Second away, round four. by Steele, the back of the knee, brought Roach down to below his height, which he wanted. Trying for the stranglehold, but hasn't got it on. And Roach still lifts him. All 15 stone 12 of him. But can he force the balance over the top for a shoulder place? Very nearly. Gets a count of two. tackle this time by Steele, but caught in a crotch hold and stood too near Roach. Crotch hold and a slam, follow down cross press, Steele, two, three. Just one and a half minutes in a round four, the equalizing fall to Ray Steele of Wakefield. One each now, halfway through the boat. Ladies and gentlemen, the fourth round, second fall of the contest, an equaliser in favour of Ray Steele. Great. It's quite certain in my mind that he could make a comeback even against this giant from Birmingham, and he certainly started well. But the next four rounds will show us whether he continue the good work. Second away, round five. Five, four to go. One fall each. Steele versus Roach. And Steele, of course, the blonde, the Yorkshireman, in the trunks, on the left there. Oh. 
leash is over for those four arms. But he was still standing there, so why not continue, Steel said. Hurt his knee, I think. But it hurt Roche too. Straight into his foot off the top rope. But perfectly legal, sole of the foot. Steel walks straight into it. Slap. He's still in trouble now. As if he gets a special. Oh, Birmingham bump, as he calls it, Pat Roach. And that could be real trouble for, for Steel. And could be quite easily the end of the bout. And he won't get up from that. No chance. That Birmingham bump. And still no chance from getting up from that Birmingham bump speciality of Pat Roach. Well, ladies and gentlemen, the fifth round and a knockout with his own speciality, the Brummagem bump. The winner, Pat 